Hello guys, so today is Tuesday, I had to think about that for a second, so fly out to Cyprus um, on Saturday to get married, so very much looking forward to that, so I'm trying to hit it hard in the gym this week, I'm trying to hit the sunbeds, as you can see, got a little bit of a summer glow going on, um, I've done a video for my DC leg training, which I did over the weekend, so I'll um, t attach that to this video and post that up for you. In regards to how the DC training's going, um, it's actually really good, I'm really enjoying it, something different, because you know, I've been in the rut of doing the same old boring bodybuilding split for about five years now, you know, chest, triceps, back biceps, all that good stuff, so... I've not quite sort of stuck to logging my lifts. I pretty much know what I'm doing in my head, but there's no point anyway, because I'm away for like pretty much nearly three weeks. Um, after I go to Cyprus, I'm going on honeymoon for 10 nights. So hopefully there's going to be a gym there, but you know, depending on what they've got, I don't want to sort of worry about it too much. So when I get back from that, then I'm going to start logging every one of my lifts and making sure that each week, you know, the weights progress and the weights progress. But you know, to be fair, I'm not really pushing my body weight up at the minute. Yeah, you know, I'll show you what my diet is now because I've just finished my meal prep. But I'm not using any supplements. I'm not using any gear. So all natty bro at the minute. Um, however, from the training, I do feel like I'm still growing, which is great. So I want to get back and push the supplements, not the gear, just the natural supplements, and push my food up as well. Um, hopefully that will improve my strength and I should see some more gains. I'll keep you updated with that. So let me just give you a quick show of what the diet looks like at the moment. So breakfast is basically I have six eggs. Um, usually I have like two or three yolks with that. I have a cinnamon bagel and a banana. Usually I'll probably add a little bit of peanut butter to the bagel as well. So I try and get a few extra calories and I do have a few tablespoons of the peanut butter. This is my preferred choice at the moment. And the dark chocolate one is insane. So definitely recommend giving that a whirl. You can get it from um, Tesco's actually. So meal number two, dead boring bodybuilder food is chicken and rice. So 200 grams of chicken, 50 grams of uncooked basmati rice. Then before the gym, I usually have something a little bit lighter on the stomach. So got a tin of tuna there, a jacket potato and a banana. Like if you're on a budget or time is of the essence, this is such an easy meal. These jacket potatoes, let me show you. Um, you actually get them from Aldi. Give me two seconds, I'm just gonna turn that fucking beeping off. That was the oven telling me my food's ready. So yeah, as I was saying, so these, I think they're about a quid for four jacket potatoes. There's like 25p a potato, absolute bargain. So also have a banana with that meal. Um, Meal after that, so usually straight after workout is some chicken and rice, a Jack of Sims meal too. Then evening, um, always tend to have red meat, so I've got a steak here. Um, it's not very big, that one. I've gone for some roast potatoes. Gonna have the gravy, because I'm an oven man. So that's pretty much the diet at the moment. Um, so I'll post my video of my leg session to finish off this little short video. And give me a comment in below, let me know what you think and if you've tried DC training yourself. And I'll try and get some more footage in before I go away. I will try and do some video in when I'm in Cyprus. I think I've wrecked a gym out there, I'm not too sure, but fingers crossed I can find one. So, until next time, peace! Don't forget to subscribe, motherfuckers. I've only got like 64 subscribers. I need to get to the big 100. Peace! Hello! Is it games you're looking for? Hello guys, so here is the DC leg training session from Saturday over at Phoenix Gym in Swindon. We've never been there, get there, it's an extremely hardcore gym and the equipment is old school but amazing. So, started off with my rest pause set for hamstring, so we did some lying leg curls. So I'll go through the rest pause principle with you, so first set, you want to be looking to get anywhere between 8 to 10 reps. Rest, so when you're resting, you're looking to take 12 to 15 breaths, hit it again, and you're looking to get anywhere on the second loop around five to six reps. Normally you'll find you get around half of the reps you did in the first rotation, and then resting again, going back into it, 
and on the last loop you're probably looking to get around two to three repetitions so after the lying leg curl i then move on to doing the widow maker which is basically just one set all out to failure so everything you've got um, so with this machine I've not used it before so the weight was actually quite light so I probably managed to get around I think it was 27 reps I managed to get with this machine or this exercise in general if you find point your toes up towards the sky rather than down towards the floor you feel a much better contraction in your hamstrings and you've got to try and bring your heels as far back as possible and really squeeze and contract at the bottom see so many people going halfway down not doing full reps and getting a good contraction on this exercise so I did hamstrings first and then moved over onto quadriceps so rest pause set for hack squats so again same principle as I've just done on the leg curl and then for quads I actually did two rest pause sets you know, sometimes you can do one or today I fancy doing two because I had a bit of energy. So I went on and did a lion leg press. So again, I did the same rest pause principle on there. And then for the Widowmaker, I did it on the leg extension. Again, pushed about 20, 25 reps. So I'll let you enjoy the rest of the video. Um, stay tuned for more videos to come. Peace!